Okay, so I'm going to keep this as short and simple as possible. Um, I want to apologize for everything that happened up until now. I was completely wrong for what I said. And as far as me taking my anger out on the person that was there, I should have never done that. That was my fault. And um, I'm a little sorry, very sorry for that. That was the wrong course of action. And I hope that you will um, forgive me in the future. But um, I also want to explain my side because um, it was clear that I the situation wasn't exactly clear to everyone else because they assumed that I started this for no reason. So I'm just going to cap back on what actually happened. So I just woke up. I look at my Discord, and Cam texted me. He said that, hey, I got kicked. I don't know why. And then I literally asked him, hey, did they send you something on the reason why? And then the, he said no. And first, I was just sitting there like, they normally send reasons out there. That's a bit odd. So. I went to go over there, and that's when my um, anxiety kicked in, um, because I was basically in deja vu. I went back to the exact same situation that I literally went back to when I was on the creator sub server. Basically, somebody got kicked, and I couldn't talk about server bans, and it was just a really bad situation through and through. So... I decided to take a different approach. And as soon as I asked that, I said, like, hey, who kicked uh, Cam? Who kicked Cam? And and then I literally was just losing my patience because I was super grumpy that morning. I did not sleep anywhere near as well as I thought I would. And I was like, anyone? And then I literally just kept questioning it because I didn't know what was going on. And then... I literally said in the course of that, because at this point I was losing my patience. I was literally grumpy as hell and it was eight in the morning. I did not want to deal with this shit. So I literally said, hey, whoever did this, you're an asshole. Whoever literally kicked him without any knowledge, you're an asshole. That's all I said. Now, fast forwarding to afternoon, because it was right after that situation happened. I get a text from Lalo, and he said that uh, there was a reason why Cam got kicked, matter of situations. If you do want to talk about server bans, make sure to contact us. Now, you guys are probably wondering why I didn't do that the first time. Remember, I was in a server where I could not talk about server bans. That was a rule. And I thought, like, hey, I probably shouldn't do it on this server either. So I didn't think about it at all. And he told me, yeah, just don't. Do that, you just started acting like a child for nothing. And I was just sitting there like, wow. Okay. And I said, sorry, man, but that's just how I'm going to act. So, fast forwarding to that particular situation, um, I wanted to make this clear that when I said that, I said, hey, I don't want to come back and deal with the same thing over and over again, where I literally have to literally figure out why somebody got kicked wrongfully. I didn't want to go back to that same scenario. That was literally like my mindset the entire time, but it wasn't explaining in words because I obviously forgot to add another sentence by saying, I can't keep dealing with people getting banned wrongfully and not even getting informed about it. So again, that was literally my mindset when I was in that situation. So prior to this, I realized what I did because I did, in all seriousness, I did literally take my anger out on Lalo. I should have never done that. That was my fault. And I should have never done that. So I did apologize to the group chat for literally um, bringing it up. And most importantly, I was about to apologize to Lalo but he kicked me by the time I literally was about to apologize. I was willing to take everything accountable. I was willing to be responsible for my actions. And I literally couldn't even set up an apology. I literally just got kicked immediately. So, yeah. 
and the funny thing is, is that, and this is not actual funny thing is, is that like one thing for sure. And this was very, very concerning. When I said that, I, I thought it was like, we don't need the negative energy. Okay, cool. But with Lalo, it's almost like it was a different story. It was like, Hey, you pierced my heart with this one. I'm like, I don't know how the hell I did. I mean, all I said was, sorry, but that's how I'm going to act. To reiterate everything up until a few days later, um, I was like, hey, I'm going to take a visit to go and see what they're doing. Because one thing for sure, there was three things I was willing to do because I went on the server to one, go and check up on them and literally add them back because I forgot to add them back as soon as that happened. Number two, I literally wanted to check on how everybody was. I care for them. I really do. Even though there was a lot of beef between me and Layla, apparently, I just wanted to check on and see how they were doing. And then the third one, and this was mostly a purposefully thing because I wanted to test and see if this was actually true, like my theory was true, because... Before I even went on the server, I literally asked myself, like, is it just me, or did Lalo take that personally? Like, I can understand if it was, like, a negative thing. Hey, I was being, I was disrespecting you. I should have never done that. That's server ban. Boom. All right. Fair. But it's almost like it was more than that. It was definitely more than that. Because... I'm just sitting there like, there had to be some other reason. So I decided to put it in a test. So I decided to bait him. And I know that was a bad idea, but I had to bait him. Because I wasn't going to come back to the server anyway. Because I already knew that I wasn't going to come back after my actual actions. So I knew I wasn't going to do that. So I was going to get banned. But I wanted to test to see if he was actually taking that shit personally. And long and behold, he actually did. So, I'm going to say this first, and then I'll get everybody else on the other way. Lalo, I am very, very sorry for the way I acted and the way everything went through. That was my fault. I should have never done that. I took a lot of responsibility and accountability for that particular incident. So, I am very, very sorry for that. But there was no reason to take it personally on me, dude. There was really no reason. I, I am very sorry for that. So, just to let you know, I did not mean anything by it. And as for everyone else, I want to apologize for my later actions and everything else because I felt bad. And when y'all literally were in that position, I felt like there was no reason for me to literally put you guys in that position at all. There was no reason for that whatsoever. So I am sorry to the entire server. I am also very sorry to Miss Reality. I'm very sorry to Lalo. And most importantly, I am not a very bad person. I am not. I just, I was grumpy that morning and I wasn't in control of my feelings. That was my fault and I should have never done that. Point blank, period. There was no reason for me to do that. So, that is it. I really, 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 really hope you guys have a fantastic career. You guys do everything you can to make it out of here Keep the grind up, and I'll still support y'all, even if I'm far away from the server. Most importantly, I am very, very sorry for everything that's happened. Farewell.